Hi, I'm Brian Clock. We're live in Panama Beach 2012. And uh, we get to debut the Donate Life bike here in Panama tonight. Uh, it's a bike we did for a young man who worked for me. His name was Vic Briggs. Um, Vic was killed in a car accident last year. And uh, he's 29 years old. Vic was the kid that answered the phone. Every time you called in, it was Clockworks, this is Vic. And um, Vic was just a great guy. He had made a lot of turnaround in his life. He was a super dad to his kids. He left behind a nine-year-old stepdaughter, two, two seven-year-old twin girls, and a one-year-old boy. And uh, the irony of it is their kids, all the kids' names are BR. So it's Brittany, Brandy, Bryson, you know, the whole deal. And uh, so on the front fender of the bike, it says the BR kids. It's really dedicated to them. And uh, we put an e-blast out and said, hey, you know, Vic passed. Um, we're terribly saddened by it. We're going to start a fund for his stuff, you know, for his kids. And uh, people were calling from Thailand, all over the country, all over the world, saying, hey, I want to buy a gift card. Just put it in the bank for Vic. You know, this is what I want to do. And it was a super cool deal, just the outpouring. Suddenly got a call from uh, Gary Gray at Vision Motorcycles. And he said, Brian, we know you're a really tight-knit group. And what we'd like to do is give you a motorcycle. We could stroke a check, but we know that your team is so amazing, you'll tell a better story. So they gave us the bike. I asked the guys what they wanted to do. The whole team got around. It was all 17 of us standing outside at a picnic table. And I said, what do you want out of this bike? You know, and they said, well, it's got to have tattoos on it. And Vic would have built a cafe racer style bike. That was his thing. So we did it for him. Uh, thanks to the folks at Victory. Thanks to the guys at Lloyd's for supplying stuff, Metzler tires. I mean, it's just been unbelievable. Super Trap, Kirker gave us exhaust. Um, Darren Wenzel of Gasoline Art down in Austin, Texas did the paint. And the bike is sick. Um, I just got to ride it over here, just uh, ripping up to the top of the deck here at the party. Thing sounds great. And Vic, just so you know, that little black mark on the floor, eighth floor, that's probably yours, buddy. Um, and we're just excited about it, you know. I mean, through tragedy, we can tell people to check the box. As they warmed Vic's body up to harvest his organs, um, the, uh, they thought they weren't going to be able to use his heart. Uh, Vic's heart went to a 14-year-old boy who only had two weeks to live in Wisconsin. And we joke around now at the shop that somehow that little boy's gonna have a penchant for vanilla ice cream and tattoos because that was Vic's deal. Every time you'd look for him about lunchtime, he was over at the ice cream lady place getting whatever he could get. And, um, you know, it's a sad deal, but with anything, um, you know, the good Lord will give you an opportunity and it's just what you're gonna make out of it. And so we're really here to raise money for Vic's kids, uh, first and foremost, but secondly and more importantly, donate life. You know, Austin Scheiman, his name is on the back of the bike. Uh, Austin was a kid who died uh, two years prior to Vic. It's my, I say he's like my wife's son. Uh, it's her best friend's kid, family friend. Uh, Laura was there at the hospital when he passed from a motorcycle accident. And ultimately, you know, his organs went everywhere. We've got to see a 70 year old man who had five kids and get to lay your head on his chest and hear his heart. Truly amazing. I mean, I don't know how you can, how you can pay the gift of life forward any bigger than that. And, through his, all of his organs, his mom knows where he's at and, and his, his love and the love that she has for him goes on to help other people. And uh, so please check the box, you know, and check out Tattooed for Life. Thanks to Victory, thanks to Panama Beach for having us and I can't wait for you to see it.